Hello everyone. Let's face it, we all make completely reckless purchases from time to time. It is a way to relieve stress, improve our self-esteem, or just cheer ourselves up a bit. However, some purchases can play a bad joke on us, or bring us incredible luck. Today, we have a few stories about shocking purchases, which didn't seem special at first, but turned out to be extraordinary. Let's get it on. Bear Dog one day during a vacation, Miss Su from the province of Yunnan in China decided to buy a cute little Tibetan Mastiff puppy. It's a large Asian dog breed that has been guarding Tibetan monasteries and helping nomads in the Himalayan mountains for centuries. This happened in 2016. Over the next two years, the woman took care of her pet, never ceasing to be amazed at its greediness and, most importantly, its continuous growth. The pets just kept growing, and its demands for food were way beyond a healthy appetite. No surprise, in one day this puppy could eat a whole box of fruit and two buckets of noodles. When the puppy's weight was already close to 200 kilograms, despite the fact that the maximum weight of a male Tibetan Mastiff is about 70 kilos, Miss Sue started to worry. Also, at some point, her pet stood on his hind legs and started walking around, and no, he wasn't trained to do that. When she went to see a specialist, Sue probably expected anything except the following outcome. It turned out that all this time the woman was raising a Himalayan bear cub, an endangered species highly valued by black market poachers. At first, Miss Sue's family decided to hand over the unusual pet to a zoo, but they refused to help due to the lack of proper documents. Later, they contacted animal control, and the bear ended up in the local wildlife rehabilitation center. Its staff, however, were completely lost because the animal was raised as a pet. He couldn't live with a family, as he would be too dangerous to them, nor be released into the wild, as he was absolutely not adapted to it. Therefore, the bear had to undergo a long course of rehabilitation and retraining, but most importantly, he turned out to be perfectly healthy. Snake House You've probably seen those scary videos where unlucky house residents in Australia woke up with a snake on their pillow and can't sleep for a couple of nights. <laughs> Well, such cases aren't as rare as they seem. The following story took place not in Australia, but in the American state of Minnesota. For Angie Whitley, a single mother with two children, life in her new home began as a real American dream and ended like a scene from a horror movie. The woman bought her new home in October 2016 after years of austerity to get the down payment. The house seemed perfect, clean, cozy, recently remodeled and in a great area. Anyway, nothing unusual. But the problem started later. On the very first day after moving into a new place, Angie noticed a snake in the house, but that was just the beginning. Soon she saw two, three, ten snakes, and six months later she had counted 95. Five. Not to mention the creatures living in the yard of the house. The poor woman had to set traps all over the place, spending more than $10,000 on pest control, but all in vain. It turned out that the snakes were settled somewhere in the foundation of the house and were not going anywhere. In the end, the woman had to hire a lawyer and demand the previous owners who forgot to mention this tiny issue about the house. Gold in a Tank People collect everything, from coins to stickers with famous football players, but Nick Mead is a British collector passionate about tanks. No, not children's toys and not even model tank kits, but real war machines from real battlefields. A couple of years ago, he added a Type 69 tank to his collection of 150 different machines. Nick bought it online for £30,000, that is almost 40000 American dollars. Once the vehicle was finally in his possession, he invited his friend Todd Chamberlain, who's a mechanic, to check the new purchase. As a specialist in his trade, Nick knew that the diesel tank could easily contain ammunition that would require the help of D miners to dispose of. The men who were filming the whole thing on camera did find an unusual surprise in the tank, although it wasn't military at all. Instead of explosives, they found five bars of gold weighing five kilograms each. Come on, girls, get your back into it. What is it? It's not a gun. Oh, God. That is. That's, yeah, that's about ton. five or six kilos. 
In case you don't know, that's a little over two and a half million dollars worth. According to the collector and the mechanic, the gold in the tank was hidden by Iraqi soldiers who fought in Kuwait during the Gulf War in the early 90s. Of course, they couldn't just go to the bank and exchange the ingots for the briefcases of money. Nick and Todd decided to call the police. Law officers immediately seized the find, but the guys weren't upset about it at all. Even if I don't get any of the gold back, I will still have my beautiful tank, Nick told reporters. That's a real dedication to your hobby. Ashes in a pendant Yet another unusual story, this time featuring an elderly lady from Massachusetts. Priscilla Bailey loved collecting blue knickknacks and jewelry, so this unusual heart-shaped pendant found in the local flea market was a good addition to her collection. For a long time, the piece of jewelry bought for a modest $3 just hung over the sink, pleasing the eye of its owner. However, at some point, she felt there was something strange about the pendant. The woman decided to look at the glass heart under the lamp and found something that looked like human ashes. Perhaps the trinket was nothing more than an urn with somebody's grandma inside. Priscilla's daughter even launched a campaign on social media, hoping to find the rightful owner of the pendant, but we don't know if she actually managed to do it. Well, even if she didn't, we're sure that Priscilla is taking great care of the artifacts that fell into her hands. War Bunker Some people find snakes in the yard of their house, while others find something much bigger. Chris Scott from Britain bought himself a house that came with a surprise. In fact, the people of Middlesbrough tried to warn him before he found it himself, but the guy believed these stories were just ordinary urban legends. One day, however, Chris was walking around his own yard looking at a grown lawn when suddenly something unusual caught his eye. It was a strange stone hatch hiding a mysterious staircase to a dungeon. The entire space below was flooded with water, as the previous owner had used the shelter as a reservoir for watering the lawn. When Chris pumped all the water, he finally realized that he had a World War II bunker in his yard. In the small space, five by two and a half meters, there were numerous objects from that time, including a wooden table and a breathing device. Moreover, the bunker had a second room. The history of the bunker is still under study. Some experts claim that the bunker was intended for the residents of nearby areas. Areas. Others argue that the bunker was clearly not built for children and the elderly, and may have even been a refuge for British officials. The future of the bunker is still unknown, but Chris admitted that a rock band had already asked him to record their new song in this unusual location. Million Dollar Photo Another story about an incredible finding made at a flea market. Its protagonist is Randy Guajaro from Fresno, California. In 2010, he bought an old photo from a junk dealer. It was worth just two bucks at the time. But Guajaro believed that the real value of the photo was much more, and he was right. As we now know, the photo shows the legendary Billy the Kid and members of his gang playing croquet in the summer of 1878. Billy's real name is William Henry McCarthy, and he was a legend legendary American criminal. He was not widely known during his lifetime, but after his death, Billy became a real legend, largely thanks to biographies about his adventures. Today, he's considered one of the most famous symbols of the Wild West. I don't know your name. Bill is my name, mister. Billy the Kid. The thing is that there are just a few authentic photos of Billy the Kid, and the photo that Randy bought is one of them. Experts studied the authenticity of the photo for several years, using digital face identification, comparing the landscape, and even analyzing the croquet set. Eventually, they confirmed their guesses and gave the photo a value of $5 million. Couch with a secret. These guys made thousands of dollars by just sitting on the couch, literally. Three students who lived together bought a piece of furniture in a second-hand market, and it turned out to be a real gold mine. But let's start from the beginning. Reese Workhoven, Callie Guasti, and Lara Russo, three friends from the American city of New Paltz, bought an old couch for $20. A couple of months later, they noticed that something was hidden in the armrests and decided to get rid of the thing that was bothering them. 
pulled it out and we're feeling it and we're like, what, what could this be? The students thought that they'd find plastic bags, but instead they discovered a stash of cash, $40,000 to be precise. Of course, they felt like kids in a candy shop. We all know that a student's life is not a luxury one. After finding the money though, they started to make grand plans about purchases and presents, but soon they noticed a name on the envelopes with the money. They talked for a long time and decided that the right thing to do would be returning the $40,000 to their rightful owner. It turned out to be an old widow from New York. Her deceased husband hid his savings in the sofa before his death. In gratitude to the guys, she gave them $1,000, and they came back home happy and with a clear conscience. Psst, dude, are you looking for new technologies and great gadgets? Are your thoughts focused on the future? Do you love huge vehicles and can't imagine your life without robots around you? Then visit TechZone and you'll find all this and more. The link is in the description. You interested? Great.